Hello YouTuber! In today's lesson we will learn how to make in C Sharp Windows services. So go to new project and select service and type uh, services services copy that okay uh, now we want to on the service CS go to right click and put installer and here is installer we need to put to a local system account and service installer or let's say put services so services description will be services and display name services and service name will be services okay after doing that go to uh, to here to see the code and the code look like this and go to services and view here code and on the start uh, put something like something like this so input output file create application current domain base directory on start txt and on the on the stop you put here uh, stop so stop and it will be a uh, basic our basic so it cannot uh, create some visual components like message box and else he c he can't uh, create that because it's for from uh, uh, it's from console. So don't uh, don't do the tr uh, thread and try catch block. Don't use any visual styles. Okay. After you done that, you just going to start that. Okay. Here it is. It start. So now we go to uh, our project uh, binary debug, and here we will put installation uh, batch file and in installation we will put code that look like this that look like this so open the .NET FX2 NET2 framework and after that install utility and service CXE this is a service CXE exactly the same thing we will do for the uninstall batch but in this case we will just put here uninstall okay and we also can do uh, let's say delete command which will be cmd c s c delete and the name of our services services next and delete services okay so now we can start the services to see if we have service which is called services so we don't have we have services name but don't have services and let's uh, run it so I open it and he's uh, he it will it wouldn't start automatically so I will refresh that with F5 and here is the services and when I start that you will see here that he will put uh, RTXT files to so start look here and you see he put on start txt so if I go to stop he will put here on stop.txt so now we can delete them so go to properties go to disabled okay and now want to delete that so go to here let's put it here and run it he deleted it and F5 and services is gone so that's all for the basic services we will next tutorial we will learn about more advanced uh, services so let's go to more advanced service we want to put all those in in the setup so we want to create setup so go to add new project and use the setup file I cannot use it from uh, uh, this this project but I can use from uh, Visual Studio 2010 but and a tutorial will come again with 2000 